How goes it, everybody? Wayne here with me to you, Game Truck. And you may have recently booked your Game Truck party, and now you have about 15 to 20 plus kids coming over, and you're freaking out a little bit about what you should do before the Game Truck arrives. And in today's video, we're going to cover five simple birthday party games that you can play with party cups using only three total items to play those games. So stay right there, and we'll have that coming up right now. Okay, so as you saw, the three items that we're going to be using for today's party cup games are going to be obviously party cups, some balloons, and ping pong balls. So the very first game that we're going to set up today is a game called Flip Cup. And this is only going to use the party cups themselves. The object of the game is to flip the cup over in the upright position before you move on to the next one. And then you want to get all five cups in the upright position in order to win the game. Now, you can do this with either a single player, you know, one versus one on each side of the table. So you would make this a team game in which each team would have five players. Each player has their own cup. And so the first player has to flip their cup over and then the next player goes as soon as the first player is finished. And then you would go until all five cups are up and the team that flips all the five cups up in the upper position correctly first, that's the team that would win. So next on our list is a simple game called Cup Race. And the object of this is to reach the cup with a different color in your stack. And the first one to reach that color is the person that wins. So what you will need for this is simply your party cups. And if you happen to have multicolor cups like this, that'll work great. Uh, but if you don't, you can always use like a sticker or some sort of identifier on the bottom of the cup um, in the stack. What we'll do is we'll take one of the different colors and we'll kind of mix them in the stack here. And you want to make sure that they're equally stacked so that they have to get to the same number first. And the objective of this is to simply race to be the first one to reach that particular color. And the first person to reach the different color is, is the person that wins. Okay, the next game on the list is called Blow the Cup. So now that you've completed a race with the cups, cup race, this one is going to be a bit of a different challenge and where you are going to require a balloon and one of the cups. And the objective of this game is to take the balloon and we're going to blow it up. And then on the count of three, you're going to release the balloon air onto the cup, pushing the cup across the finish line. The first person to cross the finish line will be your winner. Okay guys, so the next game is called Cup Collection. It's a pretty simple game. All you're going to do is take all of your cups and spread them out across the table. And the object of the game is simply to pick all of the cups up. And the first team who collects all of their cups and puts them in the stack is the team that wins. Okay guys, and the last game that we're going to play today is a game called Bounce It. You will take two teams, one team on either side of the table, and the objective of this game is to bounce your ping pong ball into the other team's cup, and then once you bounce it in, you flip that cup over, and the first team to eliminate all of the other team's cups, that's the team that wins. Again, this is something you can play either one on one, or if you wanna try making it more of a team game, you could have five players, and each player has to bounce in the opposite team's cup, and my suggestion would be to do one player at a time. Once the first player gets it in the other team's cup, then the next player will go and so on until the team with all five wins first. Okay guys, that wraps up our five easy party cup games that you can play at your next birthday party. And before we let you go, if you've played one of these games, you know, leave us a comment below. Let us know which ones you've played, uh, which one is your favorite that we went over today. And as I mentioned at the beginning of this video, you may be needing these particular games because you are having a game truck party. Uh, if you are having a game truck party and you're wondering what type of video games that might be played, uh, check out our last video where we talked about the top three video games uh, that are played in the game truck for birthday parties. Uh, you can find that video right here. And if you have any other comments or questions, please leave those below. And we'll see you guys in the next video.